I'm in my Easter dress and by a church, unlike many people who are celebrating this morning at home due to social distancing. Local clergy have messages of encouragement for people who are missing their normal Easter Sunday. Easter expectations, but the reality is many churchgoers are celebrating the Christian holiday at home. It's going to seem strange not being with my church family this year for Easter. Many of us feel the burden and struggle of isolation, separation, discouragement. The governor is allowing worship services to still take place because he believes it's people's constitutional right. Most churches in our area, however, are listening to the CDC and avoiding large gatherings. In a different way than we are today, but here we are today experiencing some social distancing. Jesus was distanced from his family, from his friends, from those that he loved and the Bible even says that he was distanced from his own father in heaven. Easter celebrates Jesus's resurrection after being crucified. It's almost 2000 years ago that there was a man named Jesus and he was hanging upon a cross. Preachers say it's the perfect holiday to feel hopeful despite these trying times. The entire message of Easter is that of hope, of resurrection. I just wanted to share with you some encouragement today. You know, it seems like we don't have a whole lot of that today. We're surrounded by sadness and despair and discouragement rather than encouragement. Encouragement that this will all be over soon and church members will be able to congregate once again. And nothing we do, even the COVID-19, cannot destroy the joy that is in the hearts and the minds of Christians abroad. Hope is that confident expectation that this moment in time will pass. If you want to connect with any of the churches from our story, we have links to their websites on CBS12.com. From West Palm Beach, Madeline Montgomery, CBS 12 News.